And we're back and this time I'm going to show you an invert monochrome effect in Premiere Pro. It's an easy effect that you see in many music videos. We'll just need some regular footage. You'll find that via description link below. And now we need two effects. The first one is the invert effect. On the video effects channel invert, just drag and drop it on your video footage. And there it is under effect controls. Now we can choose a channel. RGB is by default selected. As you can see, we could target these RGB channels individually. We'll stick to RGB. And we can use the blend with the original 100%, just restores the original, and 0% is the maximum for the invert. We keep it at 0% and RGB. Now we need a second effect, which is a simple monochrome effect. And by default, under numetry presets, we've got a couple of options. Keep in mind when you add one, and you want to try another one. These effects are overlaid. So this is the first one that I've chosen, Monochrome Faded Film 50. And if I use the punch, both of them are now active. So you need to make the first one invisible by clicking on the FX symbol. And now you see the Monochrome Punch only. And I want to keep it. I use the Monochrome Faded Film 50, so the first one, and I'll delete the punch. And this is it. Just use the invert and then pick a monochrome preset and you've got your invert monochrome effect on in Adobe Premiere Pro. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.